everyone, this is the next video in a small series where I'm going to recap some of your calculation strategies to help you when you're learning at home. This video is going to show you how to partition to multiply a two digit number by a one digit number. This is a really useful method because it actually trains your brain in how to break down numbers in order to multiply increasingly large numbers in your brain, in your mind, mentally, um, later on. Let's take a two digit number to start with, for example, 32. And I'm going to multiply it by a one digit number, a whole number, also called an integer. Um, I'm going to multiply it by five. You start by looking at the two digit number and making sure you know what that number is made up of. So a 32 can be partitioned into 30 and 2. It is made up of tens and ones, 30 and 2. So step one, partition the number. Step two is to multiply your tens digit by the integer that you're multiplying by. So we're going to do 30 times 5, okay? 30 times 5, you can do in many different ways. Please watch the previous video on how to multiply by 10 to help you with that skill. For example, I could just do 30 times 5 mentally. Some of you may not be able to do that straight away though, so you could do 3 times 5, which is 15. But the number we were multiplying by was 10 times bigger, so we need to make our number, that's the answer, 10 times bigger, and 15 times 10 is 150. So that was step two, multiply the tens digit by the integer that you're multiplying by. Step three is to take your ones digit, your units digit, and multiply it by the integer you're multiplying by. Two times five, which is 10. Now notice when I wrote my answers here, I lined up my place value columns. So here are my ones, here are my tens, and here are my hundreds. That's gonna help with our final step, which is to add the two numbers that you've got here. Okay, so we're going to do a column addition to do that. You don't have to do column addition. You could do a blank number line. You could use Dean's. You could use any of your addition methods that you're used to using. Nothing add nothing is nothing. Five add one is six. One add nothing. Some people like to put a place value um, holder there just to make sure they're not going to accidentally do these ones together. Making sure we look at the place of value of that column. One add nothing is one. So 32 times five is 100. And 60. And that is how you multiply a two digit number by a one digit number using a partitioning method. We partitioned here and then we did each part multiplied by five and recombined at the end. Have a go, try some out, let me know how you get on.